So what prompted me to become um, a digital artist, um, moving away from traditional art? Um, although I do think both are kind of integrally entwined and certainly in my position, I always have to keep up the tra traditional side as well. It's almost like going to the gym, drawing every day. When I graduated fine art school and I studied contemporary fine art at university, a friend of mine told me that people paint stuff for films and TV and I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. And then I discovered Photoshop and a Wacom tablet and then it was this mirror kind of learning how to translate what's on a canvas to putting onto a screen. I kind of formed who I was here and kind of the ambition of becoming an artist started at ACS. Actually, um, one of my main motivation to get into my industry was a family friend who did a career talk here. Now I'm in the industry and I've got, I'm, I've, I've kind of made that career in the visual effects world as a map painter, I'm a concept artist, and to be able to come back and maybe inspire some creative, you know, students to actually pursue that and not just kind of think that it's something they have to do on the weekend and that it's nothing really that they should really take up, you know, really feels nice to come back.